Welcome to Librarian Recommends. Hi, my name is Trish and I'm one of the librarians at Barbican Library. And in this video, I'm going to bring you some suggestions of audiobooks to listen to. Look out for it fortnightly on a Thursday. When the library is open, you can of course come into the library to borrow books. But did you know that you can also download audiobooks using our free Libby app 24-7? Simply download the Libby app, search for City of London Libraries and enter your library membership number and away you go. If you need help using the app, please take a look at the user guide videos on our YouTube channel using the link above. Audiobooks are a great way to experience books, especially in these times when we are all so short of free time, as you can listen to them when you're doing something else. Today's audiobook suggestions are all titles that we have multiple copies of, so they are always available in Libby. Let's start with The Victim by Max Manning. Jem Golding stops on her way home from work one night to buy some painkillers from a convenience store. As she is returning to her vehicle in the deserted car park, she is confronted by a knife-wielding stranger demanding her car keys. In that moment, Jem has two choices. She can either refuse and stand her ground or acquiesce and let her car get stolen. Fight or surrender. It's at this point that the storyline diverges and through alter alternate chapters we see the consequences and repercussions of each choice as both scenarios play out. We get viewpoints of Jem and the carjacker Norton as well as those of Drew, Jem's boyfriend, Elliot, a police officer investigating the incident, and Matt, a tabloid journalist reporting the story. This is an ingenious psychological thriller about cause and effect, examining how a split-second decision can change the trajectory of a person's life and the lives of those around them. This cleverly structured novel offers two stories in one, making it a challenging but worthwhile listen. How about The Art of Not Falling Apart by Christina Patterson? Christina Patterson loved her job as a journalist, middle-aged and without a partner or children. It was her work that sustained her through the ups and downs of life. So imagine how she felt when she lost that one constant. After 10 years working for The Independent, she was suddenly made redundant. Shocked, angry and fearful of the future, Christina decided to show to find out how others coped when life threw a curveball. She interviewed friends and acquaintances about their experiences of adversity, misfortune and the vagaries of life. In this book, Christina tells her own story and those of others who have suffered setbacks, loss, disappointment, failure, humiliation and despair. She examines how people cope in tough times, how they deal with unexpectedly bad things happening to them and how they move on from them. This is an honest, poignant, and ultimately positive book about resilience, bravery, perseverance, and surviving life's trials and tribulations. Next up is The Awkward Age by Francesca Siegel. Five years after losing her husband, widowed piano teacher Julia Alden has found love again with James, a handsome, divorced American doctor. The couple are eager to be together, so James and his 17-year-old son, Nathan, move into the London home Julia shares with her 16-year-old daughter, Gwen. Neither child is very happy with the arrangement. The teenagers loathe each other, and there are other tensions in this newly established family. Every day is an emotional minefield for this blended family. However, during a Thanksgiving trip to Boston, Julia is relieved to see Nathan and Gwen finally being nice to each other. Things have certainly changed between them, and it's not long before their new relationship plunges the household into turmoil, severely testing Julia and James's relationship. This is an entertaining drama about complicated relationships, familial love, and the conflict that can arise between the different roles and identities we assume in our lives. The final audiobook is Gender Rebels by Anika Harry. This book tells the story of 50 women who cross-dressed, 
adopted male personas or changed identities to live the lives they wanted. Some of the names in this book are well known, others less so. These fascinating women across a variety of times and cultures broke the rules, subverted stereotypes and made a difference. From Egyptian pharaoh Hapsip Suit to marathon runner Bobby Gibb, from minor Pili Hussain to musician Billy Tipton, all those featured were daring and defiant individuals who forged their own paths while often bringing about change. Narrated by the author, as well as the distinctive voices of Saran Jones, Gemma Kearney and Maya Jama. This audiobook also features exclusive material of each narrator discussing their own gender rebel heroines, female role models, feminism and how women are missing or misrepresented in the history books. This is an informative and inspiring listen. We have lots of titles with multiple copies available on Libby, so you could also try Crackdown by Val McDermott, Dust by Patricia Cornwall, The Ice House by Minette Walters, In a House of Lies by Ian Rankin, and many more. I do hope you enjoy these ideas for your next listen, even if they are different to what you usually listen to. Delving into something new can be so absorbing and enlightening. And don't forget, you can search by genre or subject and availability or simply browse in the Libby app. If you prefer to read books, look out for my Librarian Recommends video on ebooks fortnightly on a Tuesday. Please do like this video if you have enjoyed it and share it with your friends. Your support and feedback is invaluable to us. Before I go, I would like to thank my colleague Lynn for her invaluable help putting these recommendations together. Happy listening and see you soon. Bye.